If you're wanting to learn how to make this 1920s peacock flapper headdress, then keep watching and watch to the end to find out how you can win it. You will need a stretchy headband with a decorative front, some felt uh, pencil or pen like a sharpie, some sellotape, scissors, lots of different types of feathers, a glue gun and glue sticks. First step, you're going to want to draw around your decorative section of your headband um, onto the felt. In this case, I'm using a lighter colour felt and a sharpie so you can see, um, but it can be any coloured felt because you're not going to see it from the front. Now that you've got your two lines, just join them up where you couldn't draw over your headband before. I'm just drawing rounded, but they can just be straight and cut it out. When you cut it out though, make sure that you're cutting on the inside of the line so it is smaller than the headband. This means that you won't be able to see the backing from the front. You can turn it round and just check if there's any bits showing, just trim them a wee bit shorter. Now for the feathers, you want to get as many as you can. I got mine from eBay, um, but you can get them from any dressmaking shop. You can shape the feathers by either running your nail across them or running some closed scissors like your curling ribbon. That means some of them can go towards the right, some of them can go towards the left, and the straight feathers can just go up and down. Now I like to use sellotape rather than double sided sticky tape to do this because I like to be able to stick it down onto the table and lift it back up with double sided sticky tape, it just sticks to the table. Um, I use it as a base to put my feathers down, I can move my feathers about, get them into the right order and then when I have my felt I can just lift them all up in one go and put them down rather than having to transfer each feather one by one. Getting them nice and symmetrical or as close to symmetrical as possible and then putting loads and loads and loads of glue on to keep them down. If the glue moves any of the feathers whilst it's drying you can just tweak them like I'm doing just now. I got some more feathers because I wanted to have different layers and whilst the glue was still warm I just pushed them down into it and cut off the wire excess that came with these. These were just from a dressmaking shop. I think they were for hats. Clip. There we go. And these are just little decorative ones just as an added extra. I glued everything else down once again and then took my headband put it on top and pressed it down as hard as possible. This is sandwiching the back, then the feathers in the middle and then the headband down. I went round the edges and sealed them back off with glue just in case I missed anywhere and then I like just to kind of break it with my hands so it fits better to my forehead. And there you go, that's the finished piece. If you want to win this very headdress, just comment or like this video. Thank you very much. Bye!